Okay, collectors, we've got something special here. I'm not going to tell you how many of these I just received, but I have a lot of them. And we're going to be doing some unboxing. We've got the Eevee Heroes Pokemon recently released in Japan. Uh, this is the Japanese version of this, obviously. This is going to be, um, we got uh, Central Command over here as well. This is coming out in English as well at some point. Right? Kind of, sort of. Yeah? Oh, we don't know? Okay. Well, Possibly. there's... Okay. The, the next set is called Evolving Skies. It may include some of these guys. Who knows? Okay. All right. Well, you know what? We're going to open this up now. Um, for those of you uh, interested, I mean, these are on the secondary market. I know in Japan, from what I'm hearing, they were allowing people to buy three maximum or something in the stores. I think that was something that... Uh, that Nintendo was saying that they had to do. Um, Nintendo owns this company, right? Um, but uh, they were only get, able to give people three maximum. Uh, so we got a box here. We've been doing some Pokemon stuff, so I thought it'd be cool to do something uh, exotic. Would you call this exotic? It's pretty exotic. Um, yeah, okay, so let's... Uh, I'm not going to tell you how much I paid for this. Uh, you don't want to know. Uh, but I, I paid a little bit more than retail. <laughs> Honey silver column, I'm in love with you. Bunny paper column, why do you... Just a, a tiny bit more. I am going to be giving away some cards from this. So the same way we've been doing it with all the other unboxing. And um, whoever is subscribed and if you comment, you'll be uh, in the draw. I'll be choosing two people from this video that are going to be getting some cards from this break. So let's, uh, let's get this open and do it. Now there are 30... So what are we chasing here? There's uh, 30 packs in this, I believe. Yeah, 30 packs, and every box has a secret rare, and hopefully you get the next one. What is the secret rare called again? Uh, you want the Umbreon VMAX. The Umbreon VMAX. Okay, cool. So I can't remember how you're supposed to fold this. Do I need to do this? I think this comes out. There you go. I did it, man. Look. Look, 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 look. <laughs> I got, look at that. I finally got this right. It's a miracle. Look at that. Look. Beautiful box. Perfectly opened. Huh? There you go, man. There you go. EV Heroes for all of you. All right. So there you got a nice little uh, nice little flap here that shows the packs. Unfortunately, um, my Japanese skills are not very good, so I can't really tell you what it says. Um, can you read Japanese? Um, no. No? Okay. So we've got the packs here. Five cards, there's some QR codes. Um, I guess people can, what are these for? If you guys want these QR codes, you can use them. What, I don't know what it's for. I can't see any. Just advertising. Just advertising, okay. So apparently in the Japanese, um, the Japanese releases are, are quite coveted, you know? A lot of people want them. Um, would you say they're more valuable than the uh, North American release? I mean, when they, I think they print more of the uh, English versions, don't they? Mm -hmm. Especially with this set, because you get all of the evolutions. Okay, nice. Um, well, and they're saying that the next set might split the evolution, so that's why it's, this one's crazy. Okay, well, apparently there's some beautiful art. I watched a couple of videos, and the um, the rares are really, really nice. So this is interesting, this pack, because you've got the card right here, but there's a lot more room on the top flap now. I don't know if that's because people have been cutting into the cards or something but you can actually see that so it's much easier to just you know to, to to break it open because of that that's what i that's what i think so um let's get this open man and let's see what we've got um i may not know all the characters that's why i have my backup here so you're supposed to burn the first card on this okay uh and then go through the cards so of course we've got a what looks like some kind of a game here. I'm not sure what this is. If anybody knows, it looks like some uh, interesting. It's a puzzle game, supposedly. It's a puzzle game. Okay, cool. Well, let's uh, let's see what else we've got. All right. So the puzzle game goes over here, and we move the first card to the back, right? Yep. And then we turn it over, and let's see what we've got here. So first card is going to be this lady. We have no idea. Can you see everything? Yep. 
Okay. And the next card is this uh, nice piece of art, actually. That looks like a, it's that, it's that, it looks like a, like a red, the, the ball. What's that ball called? Boltorp. Boltorp. Is that what it is? Yep. Okay. It's a really nice, actually. Yeah, this does not look is. anything like the, uh, like the Shining Fates. It looks different. It's actual art, almost like actual art. Okay, for those of you that were watching, I'm gonna. Though you probably heard some elevator music. That's because my microphone cut out, so I can't stop. So I'm just gonna continue with the in-camera mic. So the sound may not be as good as what you're used to on the Jeffy collection, but right now you're gonna have to have the uh, in-camera mic. So we were here. We had the first card. There's number two. We got the. Uh, can you see the cards on the table here? Yes, sir. You can kind of see the everything that's there. Okay, we got a spider here. Very nice, very nice spider. Uh, we have a uh, a mouse. Anybody know what that is? A Meryl. Meryl. Okay, so you know, there's a guy with some teeth here. Pincer. Pincer. See, that's why I have central command here. He knows, and that's it, man. That's it. Five five cards. Anything of anything of value here? No. But those are the five cards, and that's basically it not a lot okay so let's go for let's go for pack number two of this exciting man these are these are not I thought it was gonna be easier to open this is no joke I saw some people using scissors on these and I think I need to get more experience <laughs> this is like really bad I'm opening it up like a like a burrito all right so that's not Josie Fleur, but it's another another flower of some kind. This is a another uh, lightning bird of some kind. Very nice. And then you've got <laughs> you got a blue fish in the water with something going on in the background here. There's like some some stuff you can see here if you guys have a good look. And then we got the white tiger. You know what that is? Does he have a name? Yeah, that's the Persian. The who? The Persian. Okay, great. See, luckily I have you here to explain these things. And here we have a... Oh, and that's the that's the game. Sorry. <laughs> that's the game. That was not... I, I thought it was going to be a baby shiny. Okay, there you go. Done. Let's see if I can open this better. Ah, these oh, things... From the bottom. Where? From the bottom. From here. Yeah, it still doesn't rip open. It's like you, you need you need to have a knife. I keep seeing these people they're they're using scissors. Yeah. There's yeah, a, there's a reason. Yeah, you should. I should actually pre-open these before doing the video. It'll make it a lot easier for us and not waste waste all this valuable time doing this. Okay, this is crazy. Come on, man. Okay. Here's your game. Another game we don't need. Let's burn that card. Ooh, something there. Something there. I don't know what it is. We got a uh, trainer. We have a, a sea monster. <laughs> Some th uh, The cat that's walking on a trail. Looks like something's painted on the ground. And we have this. Who's this? The purple cat. Zorua. And uh, there it is. Yes. The first hit of the day. Alephion V Max. Alephion V Max. Look at that. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Should this be sleeved? Naturally. Sure. Absolutely, we should be sleeving this. That's nice, but this is not the best. The, this is not the best of the best, right? We're still waiting. We're we're still waiting for the best of the best. So let's uh, let's enjoy what we have. Let me see if I can get this uh, this opened here. You know, it really sucks that I don't know more about Pokemon. You know, I'm doing this for fun. It's great to do this for people, but I wish I knew more about the actual cards. I've never been a big Pokemon guy, but I'm still enjoying doing this. But these packs are like impossible to open. Wow, it's no joke. All right, game, burn, switch it over, and let's see, we got a purple ball. 
Again, we have the nice little fish over here. You seeing the cards being put on the table? Yep. We got the red slime guy with a rock on him. Nice. And there's a cat. That's a nice, that's actually a nice little picture. I like that. That looks good. And here comes the next card. And Ooh. this. That's the Umbreon V. Umbreon V. Is this the hot card? I mean, you want him, but the V Max crazy one. But so, he's the guy you want. So this is a, what's the value on this one? Is this a, is this a big hit here? Uh, it's a, out of all the Vs, he's the biggest hit. He's about $10 right now. $10. Okay, yeah. let's stick him in a... He's worth a top loader, right? He's in a rookie card. He's in a rookie card top loader because I have no more room for anything else. All right. I have nothing else. And let's uh, let's throw in this guy. I actually like the way this one looks. I think it's a really nice card. You guys that like it? Beautiful. It is nice. I find these are nicer than uh, what I've seen in Shining Fate, to be honest. This is crazy. Look at look at the detail. Yeah, man. And apparently, I heard this from a bird somewhere that the um, this is the first batch. I, I don't know if this is a rumor or if this is like just a, a myth. Is it true that the first batch are usually better print quality? Uh, that's what everyone's saying right now. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Right? So I got to be careful how to open these, man. I can't I can't get these things open. Like this is insane. This will damage the cards. I need scissors. So I'm going to switch from my trusty knife to scissors. I'm going to have to put this on pause and go get some scissors. This is this is really bad. Like I literally am scared of damaging the cards. Okay. All right. Game gone. Let's burn the first card. And uh, you guys watching at home or on your phones or on your tablets, if you see anything you like, make sure you comment. All right. And uh, I will keep that in mind. All right. So here we go. We have a um, something in the water, a dragon. <laughs> I wish I knew these things more. Uh, this is a uh, man-eating plant. Amazing. I love how some of these people that are that are doing these breaks, they know every single character. Like, you're pretty good, man. You know your characters. I don't. We got this guy here. And here's another hit. Whoa, I haven't seen this one. I saw some of the pictures, but this is cool. Look at this. Oh, nice. Hey, Porion B. Hmm, what's the value on this baby? He's a little bit lower. I would say around $5 at the moment. Five dollars at the moment. There you go. But because people can't find these right now, I'm wondering if the value is higher for North American buyers. This is actually a really nice, nice looking card. Quite impressive. Uh, so for those of you watching, let me know what you think of these. Um, I gotta, I gotta do something. Give me a second. I'm putting everything on pause here. I'm going to get scissors. Going up the stairs and going down the stairs and going up the stairs and. All right, Jeffy is back and he's got his scissors. I should have learned from watching other videos. So now we're gonna cut along the edge. And I didn't, and I did, I did it. I, look at that, look how much easier that is. It slipped, it <laughs> slid right out. Okay, game on the side, paper over here, burn the first card, turn the cards over. That's a nice little, little look at this, nice little colors here. There's one, and then we got, oh, that's the same one as before, except uh, it's a guy painting the floor. It's like the same exact image as before, except a different character. Yeah, his name is Smeargle. Smeargle. Smeargle? Smeargle, yeah. And he paints stuff on the floor? Yep. Okay, and then we have another flower. And then we have this guy who's like a demon with green pants. Very nice. You see, you saw, you saw this guy? Very nice. Morgrid. Looks like, sounds like something out of Harry Potter. <laughs> Very cool. So any of these uh, should be sleeved. You let me know. As long as they're shiny. Bees, bees and big full art stuff. Okay, so that's the only time. So let's slide these out. All right, game to the side. 
Same as usual. Burn the first card. And we got a little dragon in the water. Beautiful. All right. Another fish. Oh, this is a cute little character, like a blue rabbit. Yep, his name is Azumarill. Azumarill. Good. And Cham. And that's and it. A trainer. And that's it. Trainer? Yep. Cool. We need those. Those are mostly for the game, right? Yep. All right. Opening the next pack. Burn it. All right, I think we got something here. I saw something shiny. All right, Snowflake. Uh, you can see this. Uh, slightly, I thought. Can you see when I shift when I when I shift like this? Yeah. <laughs> we need we need this guy to see because he can explain to you guys what the cards are. You see that? Yep. Okay, cool. So it's a cleaning lady. Nice. This is uh, Josie Fleur's mom. <laughs> and, and this is some lava. Slava. And you know you know these guys. And this is another guy. Oh, looks like Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan. All right. I don't mean to be butchering these names. Oh, the scissors are great, man. I got to get a nice pair of scissors for the Jeffy Collection channel. We need a better pair, a really nice looking pair to go with the channel. All right. Burn the card. And let's see the green, the bubble, <laughs> the red flower, and the blue guy, and another trainer card, right? Is that what that is? Just another trainer, yep. Okay. So this is going pretty quick. They gave a lot of packs though, 30 packs. Only five cards though, but still. Why don't they just put 10 cards per pack? It's a waste of paper. Only for the special set. <laughs> okay, great. But it's still a waste of paper. All right. There. Star. Uh, what's that mouse called again? Meryl. Meryl. And then we got uh, the sand with the eyes. Beautiful. We got the spider. Very nice. And we have the dragon in the water. And, and we're getting the names from the central command here that knows the characters. Oh, the scissors. We just, we just cut this video in half by using scissors. <laughs> Seriously. All right. Switch this around. And let's go through this. Here's another card. Nice, nice art. Hey, Pikachu, I know him. Pikachu yeah. always looks happy in every single video. Look at that. Pikachu. Does that remind you of any other card or is that pretty much... Should I sleeve this? If you want. I mean, I it's mean, Pikachu. It is Pikachu, right? So, and then we got a Manta Ray. We got the Cleaning Lady again. Nice. And... <laughs> wow. Beauty. And V. And value on this baby. That's a nice card. Maybe we should give this one away. Maybe. I think one of our subscribers deserves this, right? They, they work. Got a comment. They got it. They comment. They put up with the video. They put up with my non knowledge of Pokemon, and uh, they deserve a nice card. That's a nice card, though. I like this. This is actually the nicest one. So far, in my opinion, but, and you know what, just because it's, just because it's Pikachu and I respect the fact that it's Pikachu, he's going to go into a sleeve as well. All right. Okay, cool. So we only have another, another 56 packs to go. We're almost there. Let's burn this. Let's turn this around. Yeah, we got something shiny. Another, something else in here. We got a hit in this. I saw it. You, uh, This is a, uh, a white dragon. Another blue rabbit. And a drop of water. Another Pikachu. And here it comes. A oh, baby, it's a baby shiny, right? No. Uh, it's just a hollow. 
Wow. Boss. These are way nicer than in Shiny Fate, uh, Shining Fate, man. It's got a shine, a shimmer all around the edges. Look at this. You got to see this in person. You see that? Yeah. It's got a lot more shine. For those of you that have been opening Shining Fates, I mean, look at that. Even this is sick. Wow. That is nice. I don't care, man. I'm putting him in a sleeve. It's too shiny. <laughs> it's too shiny. It needs to be in a sleeve. I mean, they make you put them in a sleeve. Even the cards that have no value because they look so good. All right. Cut. I should just cut them all open in advance next time. All right. Let's burn this. Okay. Oh, something else in there. We got a blue... Uh, the blue shark guy, sand on the beach, the manta ray, the nice artistic cat. Pancham. Pancham. Looks like Heathcliff. And here it goes. Wow. Oh, nice. That is a nice card. I think that's your secret rare. Secret? That's a secret rare? Yeah. Is that the only one in the box? Only one? Oh, wow. Awesome. You might get two. Let's put this in a sleeve. But that's the, her name's Aroma, I believe. Aroma. That's a nice, uh, we're going to be doing, we're going to be opening more of these. So we'll probably do another box tomorrow or after tomorrow. So make sure you keep an eye on the channel. And um, according to Central Command, that is our first. Is that a secret rare? Secret rare, yep. And what is she worth? She's about, uh, I would say, 50 to 75, not quite sure. So it's not, so, so it's not huge money, but it's still, uh, we didn't hit it hard, but it's not bad. It's not bad. It's, uh, it's still a nice card. Potential to go up in value, too, since this is a popular set, right? All right, sure. game, burn it, and we have a thermos. There's a, another fish. There's the panda. Is that Kung Fu Panda? That's different. That's different. Pancham's father, Pangaro. Pangaro. Here's the guy painting the road again. Beautiful. And we have the evil guy with the green pants. <laughs> More. <of them>. More. <laughs> it's so funny. It's funny going through this, especially when you don't know all the Pokemon characters, just trying to describe who they are and like, I don't even want to, I don't even, oh, there's something there. I don't, you guys probably saw that. I don't think you did, but you guys, I know you guys saw that. Okay. All right. So there's Pikachu again. We got to sleeve him up. The guy painting the road, slime lava and boom, Ooh. purple. It's an what? Espion. Espion V, nice man. It's really cool because when you, when you when you reflect the light on them, you see like it's almost like they have the, like that ruby that 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 gem that's on his um, on his head. It really shines. It's quite nice. You might have to see this in person. <laughs> yes, yes. You're gonna come. You're gonna be here for the next break, in person. Okay. Yeah. Why not? You were here. You were here last time. It was fun. Yes. Okay, good. Um, so I'm not going to sleeve that right now. Let's just keep this going. It's already a mess here. So let's open this next box. All right. Game. All right, we got the heart. We got the wings. Eve. That's Evie. Is Evie, that it? Yeah. Evie, yes. I know this character. There you go. It's <laughs> Evie looking up at the sky. And uh, what is she looking at? Something. Um, there like could be... The dragon or something. There could be a nod to the next set. Who knows? Okay. And here comes another hit. Ooh. Wow, it's shiny. I don't know what that is, but... Uh, a hollow grim snarl. A hollow grim snarl. What are we looking at in American dollars? Uh, maybe only a few dollars. Nothing crazy on that 
so pretty though. Is that a is that is that like a it's not a baby shiny, it's just a uh just a hollow for just a hollow Japanese, yep. Japanese hollow. Nice. Beautiful. Let's put these aside and let's open a couple more. It's, All right. It's made for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. So let's burn this. Oh, another hit on this one. Okay, let's see here. All right. Manta Ray, Panda Bear, Flash the Spider, and boom. This is a pretty thing. I have no idea what this is. I cannot tell. It looks like Florgis, or I don't know how to pronounce his no name. Re no relation, no relation to Josie Fleur. I'm just gonna sleeve all of these. I'm surprised you haven't seen your girl yet. Josie Fleur is not is not in this pack. We'll see. <laughs> oh, does Josie Fleur show up in all the packs? Please, yeah, man. She might, she might make a, a, a comeback. Just for me. Okay. All right. We got the White Panther. I haven't seen this one yet. It looks like a some kind of monster attacking a little dinosaur. <laughs> There's another another plant, sand, and then another small... Ooh, that's, a, that's a nice hollow there. That is nice. That's actually and cool. Two. You know this one? Yep. And so, so the cool thing that you want to see out of this, if you guys, I don't know if you guys can see this through the video, but it really looks like the claw is coming out of that card. Like it's got a nice effect. Okay. Just letting you know. Very nice. So this is going to get a sleeve just so it can be sleeved. There you go. Let's put these aside. Gonna be a huge mess over here. All right, that's a cool card. I haven't seen that one yet. Character. And then we got the little cat. We got another cat. We got a cleaning person, and we got Peek. Is that Pikachu? Pikachu's older brother, right? You. <laughs> is that really? Is that? Are you serious? Yeah. This is Pikachu's Pikachu. older brother. Looks a bit. He looks a bit bigger, right? He's a little chub. <laughs> yeah. So any value on his brother or no? His brother's got to have I some have, value. He's only about like a dollar. <laughs> it's, come on, man. Pikachu's brother doesn't get any love. All right. Not enough. Okay. All right. So we got the uh, ball. Oh, that's cool. That's Tiny nice. Mom. Looks like a tadpole on some... It looks like almost like real water. Nice. And then that's it. No hits in that pack. We're almost done. We're getting there. It takes a long time to open 30 packs, huh? No joke. All right. That's a cool picture. This reminds me of Finding Nemo. That This is actually my favorite, like, non-hollow, non-hollow card. This this piece here, here. like I nice this is the nicest thing I've seen so far. I don't know why I like it. I think this card should be getting some love from everybody. It's a, it's really nice. Does it have any value? It's really nice. There's Evie and there. Nice. Who is this? A Sylveon V Max. Sylveon V Max. Look at that. Do you like that one? He's around, uh, I would say, probably around five to fifteen dollars, roughly. Okay, so we made all we made our money back. That's that's what counts, right? I mean, it's important to enjoy opening these, but you gotta, you know, it's nice to make your uh, your investment back on these cards and also enjoy the artwork. This is it, I, I like this card. Nice. All right, so next up. Burn this. All right. Beautiful. Oh. Is, Joseph Fleur. Is this Josie Fleur? Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay, good. All right. So yeah, so Josie Fleur. But Josie Fleur is in a different pose. I think she looks better in this in this one. The other one she looks aggressive. <laughs> That's true. And then we got the monster here. I forgot the name. Uh, Josie Fleur is not gonna get sleeved. So what do you do with your uh, with all the regular base cards? Um, I just I just store them for now. How do you store them? You put them in a book? Uh, just in a box. In a box? You you throw them in a box or you? Yes, sir. You don't put them nicely in a book? Uh, I don't have any binders, so. No oh, not yet. a binders. Okay, <laughs> yeah. So is there a point of really putting them all in a book? I mean, that's a lot of wasted pages, right? Try to complete the whole set. Yeah, right. you're right. This set has only about a hundred and one, so not too bad. We've seen all these. Josie Fleur again, double Josie Fleur, yeah. and another one. It's the same one. Nice, Sylvia and V. It's the same character, isn't it? Yep, he's about five to ten. Okay, cool. Those of you watching at home, hope you're enjoying this. Let me know what you think of Sylveon V. Oh, I got that in. Right in the, right in the top loader. Look at that. So we'll keep that there. We've got four packs, five packs left. Oh, there's my favorite card. All right, burn it. And there's a flower with a moon on it. There's my favorite card again. You want one of these? I'll give you one of these if you want. I'll take one of those. <laughs> I'll, actually, you can take a bunch of these. All right. As part of a uh, part of my mutual uh, partnership here um, with Central Command, helping me out on the names, he gets all these cards. Okay, there you go. And then, boom. And that's it. Nothing there. We've got four packs after this. And then we are finished. And then we have to clean up the mess. And then edit the video and then upload it to YouTube. But you guys don't need to know all that. Nice, we've seen this card before. And that's something we haven't seen. Re Ren Gik Renjiki. Alright. And now we're opening this. Burn it. EV, again the same guy, and that's it. No hits. You saw everything? Yep, they go by fast. <laughs> they go by. <laughs> Nothing exciting in those last two packs so far. Something in here. I just saw it on the corner. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Boom. That's an evil card. I wonder, is, that, is this an evil character? I think his name is Zoro. 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 How, how do you even know this? Hard to pronounce. <laughs> no, but how do you know? Are, uh, you've seen this card before in other packs? Okay, that's good. All right, here we go. Oh, there's some. There's another hit in here. There's something else in here. And here's Evie, and behind Evie is. Is that just a hollow? I think his name is Swamper. Just a hollow. Swamper. Swamper. Swamper is gonna get sleeved. All right, two packs to go. And we did not hit the uh, hit of all hits. Maybe in the next box. Everyone needs to tune in again. Yeah, yeah. Well, we still got some decent stuff. And it's cool, you know, people haven't seen everything from these breaks yet, from these uh, this collection yet, so it's cool to see what people get. We've seen all these before. And here comes the last pack, everyone. The last pack of this video. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed this. And again, 
I'll be looking over the comments and randomly picking two people from this break and sending you some cards. I'm glad you guys have received your cards, have enjoyed them, and I love giving cards out. That's why I do this. Honestly, this is why I'm doing this, to give you guys cards. Okay, there you go. Look. Let's see. We haven't seen this one before. That's a trainer. And then we've got this. And Josie Fleur has to be the last card. And the Sand Castle is the last card. And that is it for uh, EV Heroes, box number one on Jeffy Collection. And uh, I got to clean up now, so we'll see you guys soon.